quickly show to you guys um, for a month what are all the things that I'm carrying with myself. I, I forgot to mention about this thing as well, a uh, super nifty tool. Quickly show to you guys for a month what are all the things that I'm carrying with myself. I am packing light. Um, I've usually traveled a lot of business uh, travel. However, this is going to be the first time I'm actually backpacking and it has to be a mix between a little bit of luxury, a little bit of being super light and just taking the bare bone essentials with me. So come along, I'll show you guys uh, I'm packing. Uh, right off the bat, I have a couple of uh, packing cubes over here. Um, I'm going to be landing in Bangkok and Bangkok has a lot of wonderful clothes markets. Patuna Market is one of the first places that I intend to be at. Um, and this is going to be useful for storing a lot of t-shirts and shirts that I get from there. Uh, clothes in general. So empty packing cubes. Just in case, I'm carrying a pair of shorts with me. I got this from Old Navy. I have a packing cube specifically for my slippers. There you go. Let's set that in. I have a packing cube for my intimates, uh, undergarments and such. Here, um, I have a packing cube for uh, two shirts and a t-shirt. So let me set that in a little over here. These are just bare bones. Like I mean, if, uh, if I land in Thailand and I don't have anything to go along with, this is going to be sort of sustaining me for a few days. Medicines. This is. You cannot scrimp on this at all. I have everything from uh, thumbs for tummy aches, uh, Vicks wake rub, uh, grab all, diarrhea relief, hydrolyte, masks, a lot of masks. Never, it's not, uh, it's a very low hanging food effort to be safe. So, setting all of that in. And you need to have your toiletries kind of in this uh, ziplock container so that it's very visible when people are kind of taking a look at what you're bringing. So it helps make your transition through security really straightforward and simple. I'm gonna be putting it right on top so that it's very clearly visible to the security lens or the x-ray that they do. So that's the suitcase and I intend to have both of these as a carry-on luggage. So that is gonna be really straightforward for me. So that's the suitcase. Now coming to the uh, backpack. So I got myself a nice backpack from Decathlon, it's 40 liters, this should suffice and I should be able to bring this with me as a carry-on luggage and it opens up clamshell side as you can see over here. So it's kind of like a suitcase without the actual casing but it's got really good support in the back so that's the main reason I got this. I'll do a detailed review of these, uh, this kind of bag that I have but for now I'll just show to you guys what I'm adding for my trip. This is going to be my gimbal. The Pohem ICDN6. I've been having some issues with my left wrist recently, so wrist brace for that. I have uh, two, this is where I add all of my cables at. This is going to be one of them. Cables and anything electronics related basically. That sits in right there. And then there's the second one, which holds, that one was for the cables. This one is going to be for all equipment. So light, microphone, my headphones, uh, Remotes, stuff like that, power bank as well. This is a hard case. Uh, right. I have my shaving equipment over here, grooming, personal grooming kit. Uh, sits in this nice baggie that I've had for over a decade now. So it works out. A towel just in case. I did bring a couple of um, power adapters for international travel where they have different. Uh, uh, power outlets, uh, wall sockets basically. So two of those. I'm carrying an empty box with myself uh, for my action camera. Nice little folio that holds all of my um, documents. My documents, my notebooks, pens, things along those lines. Anything stationary and documents related. Uh, so let me just get this properly. As you guys can see, I'm traveling really light. It is mostly the equipment that I'm carrying that has the most amount of weight to it or the volume that is uh, consuming. I also, just in case, I have to check in that bag. I have a uh, pair of shorts with me over here. So, there's that. And then finally, I have a bottle with myself. Uh, 
you always have to carry some locks. Uh, have one lock over here. My laptop goes at the back of the bag, in the bottom. So it's going to be against my back. So there you go. That is what I'm taking with myself for my trip. Sorry, I forgot to mention about this thing as well. Super nifty tool. Kind of I think like a fanny pack almost. But basically, this is what I keep all of my very special documents in. My passport, boarding passes, something that I need quickly. So it's also got my uh, sunglasses, some little dumbbell. And it's uh, got a pen, it's got uh, a spare phone in it. Um, yeah, this is super nifty. This is something that's always going to be on my chest for the important things. Plus, it's waterproof, so it's beneficial for where I'm going for. So there you have it, my packing for a month. What do you guys think? How do you pack when you're traveling? Let me know in the comments down below. Check out what my trip is gonna be like by subscribing to my channel and turning on the notification bell. See you all at the airport, bye for now.